Panama City Beach Fire Rescue looking to hire seasonal lifeguards to help protect our beaches this year. And we're learning more this morning about what it takes to join the team. Mackenzie McClintock live for us this morning at Frame Brown Park. Good morning, Mackenzie. Hey, good morning, Chris. The first step for anybody to become a seasonal lifeguard here in Panama City Beach is to come to a swim tryout, and that's what we're learning more about today from Will Spivey, the beach safety director. So, Will, let's talk about how people can get plugged in. When is the swimming tryout taking place? This Saturday, 1.30 p.m. here at the Aquatic Center in Frank Brown Park. Okay, so what do people need to bring with them, or what do they need to be prepared to see at that tryout then on Saturday? Uh, so it's it's super casual. Uh, just bring a swimsuit, goggles, towel, uh, sunscreen, uh, and some running shoes. So we're gonna do 500 meter swim, and then we're gonna do a one mile run. We just need to make sure you're in uh, decent shape, so the to be able to withstand the rigors of open water life saving. It's a very challenging environment, and so we have to we have to be prepared. And this is just step one to make sure you can swim. It's important and then uh, that you're in decent shape and then we just we take it from there you don't need any prior experience um, we'll we'll equip you with all the the training that you'll need to uh, affect rescues in the Gulf love it so then for somebody maybe who doesn't have the prior training what kind of characteristics are you looking for as far as what kind of person's gonna make a great lifeguard for you so you know you got to be passionate about um, about making a difference on the beach um, you know a lot of we have loads of visitors come here every year and, and they don't know uh, most of them don't know a whole lot about the environment that they're entering into so we're one of our main goals is to educate the public so you gotta you gotta care and and want to impart that uh, wisdom onto our visitors and you got to be in shape like I said it's it's a challenging environment um, long days out there so we'll put you through all the training this is just sort of the starting line to make sure that you're in you're in good enough shape to go through the training process which uh, we'll be doing in March Okay, sounds good. So if anybody has any questions between now and then, well, or maybe they just want to learn more about what it means to work for Beach Fire Rescue, what's a point of contact for them that they could reach out to right now? Uh, they can contact me, will.spivey at pcbfl.gov. Email me, I'll give you all the information you need, or just show up at tryouts. Um, this Saturday, Frank Brown Park at the Aquatic Center, 1.30 p.m. I'll be here. Sounds good. And we will list his contact information as well on our website, mypinhandle.com. Will, thank you for your time this morning, and we'll have more from you in the 6 o'clock hour. All right. Thanks for coming. Yeah, of course. Hey, they're getting to their swimming this morning here as far as all those lifeguards. Will Spivey has already trained up. Lauren, I'm guessing that the temperature of the water, a little bit warmer than the air temperature today. How are you doing? Yeah, you know, I'm glad it could have been a lot worse.